let me answer some of the most common questions I get from time to time. Is it hard to put together a smart saw? Will I be able to build mine even if I never built anything before? Listen, these video instructions make it as easy as assembling Legos. You'll be able to build your smart saw even if you never hammered a nail before. Just watch the tutorial once and you'll see for yourself you already have everything you need to put it together. Plus, if you have any questions, you can always ask me about it in the members area. So far, I didn't get any complaints because the instructions are so clear. But if you can't follow them, you already know about my no questions asked money back guarantee. So you can just say maybe to the DIY smart saw and see for yourself if it's the right thing for you. How does the smart saw connect to the computer? All you need to hook up to your smart saw is a simple USB cable. You probably use one to charge your phone. I'm sure you'll find one lying around your home. What kind of computer do I need to operate a smart saw? The smart saw works on any kind of computer. You can also use a laptop. If you can connect it to the internet, then you can operate a CNC machine. It doesn't matter if it's an Apple, a Microsoft computer, a Linux, or anything else. How much does it cost to build a smart saw? I put together the smart saw you'll see in the video for only $500, and that's because I bought all the parts. I wanted them all to be new and feel like I was getting real quality. The price to put together a smart saw depends on what parts you already have lying around and what you want to buy. Friends of mine managed to put together theirs for under $160, even less. It all depends on how much you want to spend on your parts, really. You can even make it from scraps using printer motors and old car parts. I wouldn't recommend doing that, but technically you could. Do I also get the app for operating the smart saw? That's the beauty of the smart saw. You don't really need any apps, programs, or complicated software. All you need to use it is an internet connection. And I already told you, you're also getting a step-by-step -step video tutorial that walks you through the exact steps you need to take to carve out a design using the smart saw. How quickly will I learn to use it? Just watch a 10-minute video once, and you'll be able to carve out your design. There's really no learning curve. You can learn to use the smart saw in no time. The time it takes for you to drop your design, however, will vary. It all depends on what type of design you want, how complex it is, and how skilled you are. If you don't want to spend too much on it, for starters, you can use other people's designs. You'll be able to find some online. What kind of wood can I use for my smart saw? There's really no wrong or right answer for this question. You can use any kind of wood. Just like regular carpentry, some types of wood are better than others, and usually it depends on what you're making. But rest assured knowing you don't need any kind of special wood. You can use anything from softwoods, basswoods, cottonwood, butternut, or hardwood. Will I need any tools? Right from the very start of the program, you'll see a complete list of tools you'll need to put together the smart saw. However, you'll never have to use any tools to carve out your own designs if you use the smart saw. All you have to do is push a button and your design will come out in a couple of minutes. You can find out more about this fantastic offer by clicking the link in the description.